What is going on, Bull Nation, and welcome to another DMZ video. Guys, today we're going to be talking about the most important keys that you will need in DMZ. Now, one of the craziest things about DMZ is not only having to find the keys, but knowing which are the keys you need to keep in order to progress within your missions. And not only that, but also help you find stuff that you probably wouldn't find anywhere else unless you had that specific key. Today, we're going to be talking about the most important keys. So if, that sounds, if you like what that sounds, a like would be greatly appreciated. Don't forget, we stream every single day, helping you if you're missing a key, we'll bring the key with us or helping you with any mission in DMZ. So let's go ahead and jump in it and talk about what are the most important keys. So let's get started. So a couple things to remember, there's going to be certain missions as you progress through the tiers that are going to be required to complete missions. And we're going to start off with the first one, which is the Abagra Key. This is the Abagra key for the underground. That is extremely important because that's going to allow you to open up the base on the bottom of Abagra, which you will need to complete a mission. So if you find the Abagra key underground, you're going to need to find at least one with one use because you only need one use. So I have a couple of them already within my inventory just because I know a lot of you guys use them. So Abagra key is definitely important. The channel seven secure room key is also a very important key. You might not need it at the early stages, but once you get in those tier four, tier five missions, you're actually going to need this key in order to open the room to get a document out. So make sure you guys have that in your inventory. I have two of these as well. The next key we're going to be talking about guys is the city hall key. Now this particular key is important to complete. I believe a tier two or a tier three mission within the island. So you're going to want to make sure you keep that there. I believe this is the one where we got to either do the computer or do the document. So keep that in mind. Next key we're going to be talking about, guys, is the control tower key. This is going to be a key that you don't need at the early stages, but you're going to be towards the end because this is going to be a mission that has you go into the channel seven editorial room and it has you going to the control tower. So you're going to need a key for that as well. Then we have the crane control key. This is going to be a tier three mission, I believe. And that's going to be important because you got to go open up the crane and extract a document from the crane control key. So you want to make sure you have that. I do want to mention the building 21 key because in order for you guys to complete some building 21 missions, which there are a ton of them this season, you're going to need at least one building 21 card. So make sure you have that in your arsenal. The next one, guys, is a downtown post office key. Once again, I believe a tier four or a tier five mission which should help you get in there. This is extremely important and should help you get stuff. Now, this one right here, guys, is the HMS Shipwreck Key. Now, this particular key, guys, is not so much important for completing missions. I actually found out about this one about yesterday, thanks to Mango, is this one's going to be important because it's going to be pretty much a guaranteed golden skull. So you're going to want to make sure you have this in case you have a mission where you got to collect skulls. You're going to want to have this key at your arsenal. The next key, guys, is the Room 403 key. Now, this particular key, once again, extremely important and one of the hardest keys to find just for the simple fact that you're going to need this early on to go ahead and open the room in the apartment to withdraw the document that you have to go drop at the dead drop. Moving along, guys, we have the Resort Main Building key. For uh, This one is going to be part of a mission that I believe is Tier 2 or Tier 3, that has you going to not only to here, but it has you going to the police station. So this one and the police station kind of go hand in hand. So you want to make sure you keep that in mind. I, I think I believe I got two of these. Uh, actually, three of these. Next up, guys, is the police academy key. And you got to pay close attention to this one, guys. If you find the police academy key, it is imperative that it at least has two uses. Now, you want to find one with three uses because you're going to need three uses to actually open up the different areas of the police station there's a total of three different rooms if for some reason you'd only find one with two users you want to make sure you do your work your way from the left hand side to the right side because the right side you get theoretically cleared through the window but if you find one make sure you at least have three users or if a couple of you guys have like a two or a one make sure you bring them together next guys is one of the most coveted keys guys which is the research center room key this is one of the keys that gets requested the most on stream. So if you have this key, find yourself fortunate. If you don't have this key, we'll definitely help you guys out. You need this to actually open up a room to be able to get out a document. Or it's not even a document or a computer from the island. 
Next guy, guys, is we we don't need the Foot Locker key. That, much. that is the, the Poppy Farmhouse key. This is going to be really important because this is, once again, allowing you to complete that mission that we had last season where we had to go to the Poppy Farm and extract a document, go deposit it, and bring it back. There's another key here that I'm currently missing, which we picked up yesterday, which guarantees you GPUs. And this is going to be pretty much a locker key that's going to be done within the uh, castle. So it's a lot. It's it'll be called locker room, locker room castle, something like that. And that one should allow you to open it up. I think it's this one. Weapon locker key. Yeah, it's this one. The Tuscan Castle weapon locker key. This is the one that guarantees you a GPU, which we have a video of. So you guys definitely want to check that out where the locker room's at and how to get the GPU. But you're going to want to get this key because there is a mission that requires you to exfil with, I believe, six or five GPUs. If you have this key, should help you get that out of the way really fast. Moving along, guys, we have the Sahuan Hotel Room Key, the 302 key. This is going to be extremely important because this is going to allow you guys to, once again, exfil with the Deagle, the Golden Deagle, which you're going to need to exfil in the Room 302. Another key that I would probably recommend you could theoretically get away with just having one, which is the Tuscan Castle Hideout Key. This particular key will help you get into the castle from underneath instead of you going in, you know, pretty much hacking the Wilson, going through the front. This will allow you to get in kind of like sneaky and allow you to get in there really fast and really easily. Overall, in general, I think that is almost all the really super duper important keys that are found within the game that are pretty much a requirement and are really important to get really good, amazing loot. So if you guys found this video helpful, informative, if I did miss a key, do me the huge favor, guys, drop it in the comment section down below. Laser, you forgot this key. So you can let the rest of the community know. But overall, in general, I think these are the most important keys currently right now that if you find them, don't destroy them. And if you have extra ones, make sure you stop by the stream and be like, Laser, I got this key. Can we share it with the community? I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you tomorrow. Don't forget we stream every single day helping you guys complete your dmc missions so make sure you stop by and hang out and follow us on twitter because sometimes youtube does a really horrible job of notifying you guys exactly when we go live thank you guys for watching i'll catch you guys on the next one